Hey what's up everybody, welcome back to Smooth Gaming and today I'm going to be reacting to another episode of Batman the Animated Series. Two-Face. Oh man. Stay away! I want no part of you! It's time, Harvey. It's time. Oh, Carlos. It's you. Are you okay, Harvey? Yeah. We have you surrounded. I'm out with your hands up and no one will get hurt. Sir, the SWAT team is in place. All right. But wait for my own. There ain't nobody can get in here alive. Except Batman. Ah! Looks like they've got a case of bat infestation. I will not rest until Gotham City has been dethorned once and for all. He chews up and spits out creeps like you for breakfast. You little weasel! I'll tear you apart! Help! Get him off! He's crazy! Get a hold of yourself. What the heck was that? Jim! I... Uh. <laughs> I guess he just pressed the right button. That's one heck of a button. We need to dig up some dirt on our dashing DA. Something really juicy. The brighter the picture, the darker the negative. Sponsor this fundraiser for Harvey. Well, Harvey and I go way back. He's a great DA. I think the pressures of the campaign get to him sometimes, that's all. Yeah, I guess so. Better marry her soon, Harv. Or I just might steal her away myself. You do and I'll prosecute. <laughs> <laughs> the judge just threw out the case against Thorne's men. But, but why? The warrant wasn't complete. Arrest! You rich twit! Whoa! Harvey! Harvey, you didn't just lose your temper out there. You were like another person. You know how some voters feel about shrinks. It takes a strong man to admit when he has a problem. Don't worry. If there's anything I know, it's how to keep a secret. <laughs> I would like to talk with Big Bad Harv. I don't think he wants to talk. He must if we're to help you. Yes. It appears you and Harvey are having trouble again. The guy's a wimp. Everyone feels anger, and it does no harm. As long as it doesn't result in bad behavior. Then maybe I'll go away. Right? Well... <laughs> oh my god! Did I do this? <sighs> Not you. But your other personality. I want you to admit yourself to the psychiatric ward over County General for a few days. Isn't there any other way? If you cut back on campaigning and intensified our sessions, we might be able to... Great! I'll do it. I told you I could handle myself. In fact, I'm in such good spirits I might announce a certain wedding date this evening. This is Thorne. Rupert Thorne. Unless, of course, you'd rather I speak with Big Bad Harv. Darling, is something wrong? No. I have to see someone. <laughs> <laughs> this is weird! Excuse me. A surprise meeting, that's all. Now? With who? Just mind your own business, all right? Is that a tracker? Nice. Every day the bully would bug him after school. Until one day, little Harvey got so mad, he slugged him one. Until he heard the bully was in the hospital. And that was the start of Big Bad Harv. You're talking to the wrong Harvey. She's just sitting there like, wow. Give me that file! He's gonna like, shock him. A good plastic surgeon should be able to repair most of the physical scars. I'm more worried about the mental scars. Harvey, maybe you should wait until... I said give me a mirror! Harvey! You need to get out of there! Run! To be continued, we know we're watching the next one. Two-Face, part two. How long has it been? Oh! Everybody down! Don't bother to adjust the picture. 
For the next five minutes, I'm in control. How much did he take me for this time? Two hundred thousand. You would have been able to help me, but you didn't. I tried, Harvey. I... Aww. Wherever you are, whatever you've become, I will save you. I'm Detective Leopold. No, you're not. It's about your fiance. Uh oh. If he does, you activate this beeper, and we'll be able to trace the signal to wherever you are. Just missed him. National Bank. That won't be a target. <laughs> I still feel that somewhere inside that monster is my old friend. Hey, this looks like something. Rupert Thorne, confidential. Money laundering, payoffs, blackmail. I'll destroy Thorne with his file just like he destroyed me with mine. <gasps> Help me. You don't know anything about me. I know that you have friends, Harvey. What about Grace? Grace? Ooh. She wants you back, Harvey. You all right? Yeah. I'm fine. Uh-oh. Hello? Grace? Harvey? Look out your window. They'll bring you to me. Don't tell them. Call Bruce. Harvey, you know that no matter what, I love you. Grab your hat, Rupee. And your checkbook. Face now. No, Harvey. This is... Was it chance that made you district attorney? Was a chance that made you fall in love with me? You don't ever need to hide from me. Is it? Uh oh. You did very well leading us to your boyfriend. <gasps> she wanted to save you. I'm so sorry, Harvey. That man needs to go there now. That file is here, all right. Now, where is it? Uh oh. Such I... a pretty face, Harvey. Let her go. Get rid of them. There you go. This is the last time you interfere with me. No, Two Face, don't! You can't let him! Harvey! Here's the only law the law of averages, the great equalizer. Mm. No! What have you done? It's all right now, Harvey. I'm here. Do you think there's any hope? Where there's love, there's hope, Commissioner. It was it, right? For you, Harvey. I first found out about Two-Face in the Telltale series Batman game, um, and he was a big part in that game, and like you kind of saw like what happened and stuff like that, so that was the first time that I was like introduced to Two-Face. And then, um, I think it was Arkham Knight, the third game, the third Arkham game, where you have to uh, fight Two-Face as, like, the ending to the game to activate the Nightfall Protocol. So, I I did that, and it was really cool fighting Two-Face like that, because I think you fought him in a bank, and it was just really fun. So, it was really, it was really cool being able to see him in the show, see how he started, and not in the game like he was in the Telltale series game. So, that was, that was fun. I really enjoyed this two-parter episode, you know? I, I've heard, like, a lot of people have been saying that, oh, can't wait to get to this because, you know, it's, really, it's a really good episode. It was a good episode. I absolutely loved it. It was so fun. And does Grace and Harvey now stay together? Because I felt bad for Grace. Like, like really bad. You know? It's like, oh my gosh.